In this video, we will show you how to fix the MS Access Error 2950. This error can occur for several reasons. Some of the possible reasons are Number 1. MS Access does not trust the database location. Database location issue. Number 2. Opening the database in disabled mode. Number 3. Macro settings are disabled. Number 4. Macros are corrupted. Number 5. Access DDE refresh option is disabled. Number 6. Corruption in Access Database. Number 7. Security Settings. We're going to have a look at five different methods by which we can fix this error. Method 1. Move the database to a trusted location. In MS Access, go to File menu and click on Options. In Access Options window, go to Trust Center tab and click on Trust Center Settings. In Trust Center window, go to Trusted Locations tab. Click on Add New Location and click on Browse. Browse and select the folder that you want to trust and click on OK. Once done, move your access database to that location. Now, try and open your access database. Method 2. Enable all macros. In MS Access, go to File menu and click on Options. In Access Options window, go to Trust Center tab and click on Trust Center Settings. In Trust Center windows, click on Macro Settings. Now select Enable All Macros and click on OK. Note, enabling all macros has significant security implications like malware exposure, data breaches, ransomware, etc. So remember to revert the settings after resolving the issue. Method 3. Compact and Repair Open MS Access Application Click on Blank Desktop Database and proceed to create a blank database. Go to the File menu and click on Close. Now. Go to the Database Tools tab and click on Compact and Repair Database. In this window, browse for your problematic access file and select it. Once selected, click on Compact and then click on Save. A copy of the database that you have compacted and repaired will be created in the same location. Note, take a backup of the database before performing Compact and Repair option. Method 4. Enable DDE Refresh option. Dynamic Data Exchange DDE. Refresh can reduce data conflicts, prevent macro failures, and ensures data integrity. In MS Access, go to File menu and click on Options. In Access Options window, go to Client Settings. Under the Advanced section, check the Enable DDE Refresh option and click on OK. Method 5. Repair your file using Stellar Repair for Access. Stellar Repair for Access helps you to repair corrupt MS Access database files. It ensures 100% data integrity and precision. It is capable of repairing and recovering all database objects, including tables, queries, forms, macros, link tables, indexes, split databases, etc., while preserving the original database properties. Stellar Repair for Access supports all versions of MS Access. Free download from here and take a trial to fix your corrupt access database files and recover your important data. This is a corrupt access file, which I am going to repair using Stellar Repair for Access software. This is the main interface of the software. Click on Browse and select the corrupt access file that you want to fix. If the location of your file is unknown, then use the Find option. Click on Repair to start the repair process. Thanks to the powerful software, the file is repaired in seconds. Once the file is repaired, it will provide a preview of the repaired file in the right pane. Click on Save Database from the menu to save the repaired file. You can either save the file at the default or at your desired location. Let's save it in a new folder on this drive. After selecting the path, click OK. This message confirms that the repaired file is saved at the desired location. Let's check the repaired file. As you can see, all the repaired data is in the file. Download the software now and repair corrupt access database files easily. Like and subscribe for more such videos.